Hello, my lovely YouTubers. How is everyone doing? I am the loquacious one, the one hit a quitter, coming at you today with a haul on uh, items that you will use in your home. So it is a home haul. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone is enjoying the holiday season. I hope everyone is staying safe, social distancing, practicing proper PPE hygiene. And with that being said, for this Christmas, I would love for you just to become a part of my YouTube family for 2021 and beyond by clicking that subscribe button, thumbs up this video if you enjoyed the contents and got anything out of it. Oh, hell, just do it for the heck of it, as well as sharing if you're on social media. So without further ado, let's get to this haul. So when it comes to home decor at Dollar Tree, you have to be very strategic. You have to know what the trends are. And you have to know how to best utilize in it. Meaning that if it's a very small piece, you might have to group it to get a kind of higher end look. Okay. And also, you're going to look for finishes that mimic something that's natural in nature or a material that you would naturally see, such as steel, copper, or brass, things of that nature. We'll give it a kind of seamlessly effort transition into your regular home decor. So we're going to start with the kitchen things I found. I was so glad to find some new um, glass uh, dispensers other than the ones that they had. Traditionally, the two-piece salt and pepper shaker sets that they had. I found these, which are definitely high-end looking. They have multiple holes, so they will be good for your spices. Okay, so if you want to do a hot cocoa bar, you can put your cinnamon, your nutmeg, your pumpkin pie spice, your allspice, or whatever you use, your cocoa. And you can use this to dispense that. That's one way you could use it. But they have this um, style right here. I don't know what the name of it is. It doesn't have a name to it. But they are a dollar piece. As well as they have these shorter ones that have a swirl design that are good for, again, accoutrements that you would use on your hot cocoa bar or your hot beverage station. Also... By cooking concepts, they have these two items that I particularly like. They are stainless steel, okay, and they have the skimmer, as well as, look at the handle, as well as they have the whisk with the black vinyl coating so it doesn't scratch. Okay, and I thought these were very, very up in looking and bring a sort of modern look, kind of professional look to your kitchen okay and everything is one dollar okay folks uh some more items that i found in dollar tree december 2020 that i thought were cute i've seen this before and i think i have one but i bought another one it's blessed it has the bicycles with the leaves on the ground and the flower bat and the baskets. I thought this is cute. So I did get another uh, another one of these. I think we all should be aware that we are truly, truly blessed. Okay. And this next item, this is like a chill mug. They used to call them chili willies. Orange is the color I found it in. It's a frosty mug. mug. That's what it says. A frosty mug. And I you can only hand wash it. It says, for best result, place your frosty mug upside down in the freezer compartment of your refrigerator for two to four hours. When the coolant, which is non-toxic, appears frozen, remove it from the freezer and uh, fill with your favorite drink. Feel free to, of course, clean it, to freeze or uh, refreeze again and again. Do not expose to direct sunlight or heat for extended periods of time do not use it in the microwave do not freeze below 10 degrees celsius hand wash only but isn't that cute i thought that was really cute for a frosty mug and i have paid more for those in the past but these would also make a great stocking stuffer for christmas they also had these new look at this ombre mug is bpa free of course with the little twist off white mouth, which I think is good because you can put ice cubes in it. And I bought several of these to give as Christmas gifts. Okay, and they did have a plastic uh, sleeve over it to um, protect it from scratching. So they weren't scratched. They all, they left, thank God, the store personnel left the covering off of it. 
Okay, folks, next I am displaying what is called a charger plate. It is long and rectangular. I will not use it as a charger plate because I don't know how you will put any plate up under this. You can use it for uh, your liquor, your accoutrements, your high cocoa bar. This has the appearance of a red metallic shiny Cadillac. Excuse the little dust flecks, the little white stuff you're seeing. It's just the dust highlighted by the camera light. But I have round charger plates that I have purchased last year that match this. So I can use it with that setting on the table, okay? And that's how I plan to use it. You can use it in your bathroom on your vanity. And I'm going to show you these right here, which are, what is they describe it as? A hand soap dispenser. Now you don't have to put hand soap in here. You most certainly could. You could put lotion or whatever you want to in there but even look how cute that look now imagine that in your bathroom be it a guest bathroom or whatever it looks so cute again you have to think outside the box and see things for different purposes okay just some random finds at dollar tree believe it or not i found these energet energizer max Batteries double A. It says is lasts up to fifty percent longer. I guess that's than the regular energizers. But for a dollar pack, that's six for three dollars. That's not a bad deal when you get a longer lasting battery. So I'll try them out. I'm just gonna do a little blind test between these and some other brands that I found at Dollar Tree, and I will let you know. Now, this item does not come from Dollar Tree. It comes from Dollar General, but it's still in the dollar category. It's by Ninsar. The, it says the U Essence Oil Soy Candle. And it's in rose. I wonder what you mean. But anyway, I smell these. They smell terrific. They're soy and rose. Oh, one is rose, I'm sorry, and one is violet. Okay, so I should have got more. These are gone. These will make a terrific gift. The tag is removable. These are about the only can candles I would give is why I included it. One is a rose, one is a violet. Smells terrific. So if you have to stick a candle in really quick, I would recommend this. Ninsar. If you can still find them, I can't open the box. But I'm going to Dollar General today and see if I can find some more. I really doubt it because I think it was in with the Christmas merchandise that they put on display. And I think they're really just gone, especially when people find out that they're soy. Okay, folks, something that is currently trending and also makes good gift items uh, are these banks and plaques and table uh, decor that they have. At Dollar Tree, I've hauled several. Um, the two I picked up lately were these banks. This one has a black frame. There's the hole. It says save now, spend later. And definitely the background is doable. I can deal with this sometime. You don't like the background. And the next one, it is a bank. Also with this pretty pink glitter frame. It's girly girly. Good for your teens and tweens. And in between, it says treat yourself. And it has a background of purple, pink, and aqua diamonds. So these are lovely stocking stuffers to add to your gifts. Okay, your gift baskets or bags or what have you. Also, I like these little wood decors. You can put them on a wall. You can put them on your table, your mantle, or what have you. Put them on your tablescape. Multitudes of ways to use these. Um, they are mantras that I subscribe to. Um, they mimic wood. They are stained. They are wood. Um, it has a little heart-shaped uh, piece in the front. It says blessed. But notice on the side, they also decorate it with hearts. And I am truly, truly blessed and know where my blessings come from. Am I grateful? Always very grateful for everything, no matter how big or little. And this also has the stars that mimic that uh, piece in the front and thankful you should always be thankful 
Okay. Don't wake up thinking, oh, I don't have this. I don't have that. I can't do this. I can't do that. Be thankful for what you can do. And of course, it has the little cloud shapes around the edge. Very, very good. And you can even put it in a gift setting for a friend. Okay, folks, take a walk over to the Crafter Square area of Dollar Tree. And you can find some items that you can use in your home decor. These are mainly for DIYs. That's the purpose of them. But I found some that I can use strictly as it is. Because as I said, more natural looking items are more high end looking. Okay, I found this little crate. You can stain these or embellish them any way you want to. Uh, with They have a lot of little wood um, overlays, letters and numbers and wordings that you could use for these. And you can put your uh, spices. You can organize your drawers with this. Uh, you can definitely build a cocoa bar with this. I've seen Bargany Bethany do that. So again, again for the DIYers, take a look over at the Crafter Square area. Also, they have this Crafter Square Wood Craft Cube. It's 2.25 inches. A lot of things I know that you can do for this. I have a DIY I will utilize this with. They also have this. It's described as a wooden pence pen holder. I would use it just as it is. I wouldn't do anything with it unless you wanted to just stain it. Okay, but they had it in this circular shape as well as they had it in a square shape. Okay, now look at these. Isn't this darling? It says thankful, grateful, blessed. Okay, again, those signs I showed you before had those same mantras in it. Okay, and it has a little LED light. So I think that is cute for a foyer or mantle setting or even for your kitchen. And next is my favorite, one of my favorite shapes, a pineapple. I like the pineapple and the floor de lis. And this is awesome with the LED lighting. And this is simply a uh, pineapple wood overlay that you would use for your DIY projects. Okay, folks, another thing I found in the Crafter Square area is this item that's described as a wood hanging decor, and it hangs with this little jute string. Now, one thing you could do with this, and I'm sure all you crafty DIYers have ideals and would know what to do with it, but Crafter Square also has these wood letters. They also have numbers. It's 26 pieces in each pack. So with that being said, if you wanted to use more of, uh, excuse me, I'm trying to maneuver something. If you wanted to utilize uh, more than one letter, you would have to get a set for each extra letter. That's the downside. But just to show you uh, what these letters look like, they're like little chipboard letters. And you could put a saying on there or spell something. Of course, you would have to finish those or whatever with that and they also have the wood clothes pins and this is 24 pieces and I'm going to do a DIY with that so again check out crafter square for some DIY if you're a crafter or you have an idea you want to personalize something or just you know zhuzh up your area and you need a little something extra crafter square might have some ideas for you and don't forget to check out the um uh, flowers I didn't just because I'm I have so much to do I just wasn't in the mood but they do have a lot of floral over there so check that out as well as for your picture frames I have a ton of picture frames can't possibly use too many more but they have a galore of them that is the place to get your um, picture frames and if you see ones you like jump on them if you see something you want and you can't get it or you wanted them multiple numbers Check out DollarTree.com. They will even ship it free to the store and you can pick it up. Okay, folks. Last but not least, Dollar Tree also had a lot of these wood signs and various sayings. This one says hello. And I can't recall the other ones. 
but this is the one I'm more, more or less interested in. You can put this in any of your doorway entries on your mantle, bookcase, uh, your desk. You know, you can, I will leave it natural, but you can definitely, definitely stain it. I might end up staining it. You could bedazzle it or embellish it in any way you want to. The only limitation is your imagination. Okay, folks, and that's it. That's all for this haul. Thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you're practicing social distancing. Remember, mask up, wash up, and back up. Okay, this pandemic is not over, even though we do have uh, vaccines that are out there. It still takes a time for um, this to subside and go away. So don't go out there and just let your guards down. And don't forget, if you're not a part of my YouTube family, if not, why not? Click that subscribe button. Become a part of my family as well as thumbs up if you got any contents on this video and share if you're on social media. I hope everyone have a warm, safe, blessed holiday season, whatever you celebrate. I'm looking forward to seeing you again to the next video. Mwah. Love you all. Bye-bye.